our culture. They have been there with us since a long time. Right from Shakespeare all the way to James Cameron, we like to hear all kinds of stories. We watch movies, we watch, we read books, we watch television, we listen to songs. These are the different ways of consuming these stories. These are the different ways of consuming media. Even video games consist of stories. I remember those times when my grandfather used to tell me tales of Tenali Raman, Mahabharat, Ramayan. And one of my favorite childhood activities was to listen to the stories of the great Indian warrior king, Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj. Shivaji's mother, Veer Mata Jizabai, used to tell him a lot of stories, stories of kings and queens, stories of gods and goddesses, stories of the right and the wrong. And this inculcated in him the values and morals that made him think, that made him think at a very early age of just 16 and take an oath to build the largest Maratha empire of all time, the Hindavi Swaraj. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the power of storytelling. In this technological age, various advancements have enriched our experience across various mediums. But bedtime stories, they still remain the same. Bedtime stories are still in their ancient forms. Over the years, I have extensively worked with technology, right from projects related to creating smart houses all the way to creating smart bags. This passion got me into the MIT Media Labs Design Innovation Workshop, where I worked on voice controlled printing. After the workshop, as a Design Innovation Fellow, I wanted to recreate, I wanted to recreate this experience of storytelling with the help of new technology. With my grandfather no more, I was not able to get the old magic of storytelling back, but I took the help of new technology. So with my team members, Venali Sonone and Shubankar Poddar, we took the best of the resources and put them all together into this concept of storytelling. And the result was, yes indeed, Magic Pillow. The Magic Pillow embeds new stories, embeds the new mythological stories into the pillow itself and we look at the stories through the window of our phone. We can not only just see stories, we can rather get immersed into the stories and experience them from within. We can change the angle at which we are watching the movie or, which, or at which we are watching the story. We can focus on one particular character. We can even interact with the characters of the story. Now that we have heard so much about the story, now that we have heard so much about the magic pillow, let us experience it.
Magic Pillow is more of a platform than a product. It is a platform for animators and artists. It is a platform for script writers and designers. It is a platform for us, the youngsters, to build stories, to build mythological stories on Indian culture. In the end, I want to leave you all with one thought. Imagine in the future, if this small pillow can hold so many stories, can hold so much information, in the future, how much, imagine the amount of information that our day-to-day -day products will hold. So, ladies and gentlemen, the day is not far away when companies will be selling stories, not products. Thank you.